Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Friendly Fire. This is Austin. Derek. Woo! And today we're playing Hotel on the fucking Great. Uh, I don't know what the fuck that means. I don't know if we're on a literal great, but I did read uh, that we are apparently a traveling therapist, I think. And uh, the main point of the game is we're traveling around the town uh, to go to our patients. Uh huh. But uh, also, it looks fucking wacky, so. I mean, the music's great. Yeah, the music's I mean, so, so far. Fun. This is our fire jam. Okay. Well, yeah. let's get into it. Alright, I'm playing this one. Okay, I've got the classic here. W S A D. <laughs> <laughs> oh, J yeah. or tab equals journal. Okay. Left. Okay. Alright, let's go, All baby! Right. Nope, from no hotel. Alright. Okay. <sighs> okay, dear Mix, Mr. <laughs> Mrs. Therapist. Okay. I'll, re I'll read it fast because it looks like a lot. It's probably nothing. Uh -huh. <laughs> your facilities have been contracted to offer therapy services bi-monthly to our long-term residents. It has been three months without any response from your office. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like a, sounds like we got a tight-ass work ethic. We accepted to pay you in full upfront, given that you, you are prompt and follow the guidelines of our mutual assigned contract. You have not fulfilled your end of the bargain. If your services uh, are not provided by tomorrow, 626 x our lawyers will be contacting you. We will trust you still have the information and room numbers of our long-term guests. Please take care not to disturb our short-term guests for the conditions of our contract. One of our rooms sits empty should you need a brief respite. Thank you, Grandpa, manager oh, and owner. Is that our grandpa? I I hope not. That was like some nepotism. Like, Otherwise, we, we haven't been working for like three months. <laughs> well, they said they, they played us up front, so. Right. Now right, you want to get this one? Look, kid, I fucked up on this one. I figured those two old... <laughs> Codgers at the hotel would have forgotten our arrangement. We wouldn't have to do any work. <laughs> Obviously, I was wrong. They got my phone ringing off the fucking hook. I'm gonna need you to head down there real quick before the old timers get. That's that, that's quite the play to just be like, Litigious. damn. I thought they would just pay us up front and <laughs> fucking forget about it. Like, <laughs> right. Uh, just go listen to these idiots' problems and come back home. I'll give you a bonus or something. This contract is from a while back, so our patients should be filed somewhere in your journal, probably towards the back. Good luck, your friend and boss, Harold Johnson. Founder and lead the old therapist at Door to Door Therapy Services. Also, don't forget, WOC to walk. Left click to interact. Okay. I know how to play video games, boss. God, I, just played, <laughs> I played them for three months while I wasn't giving people therapy. <laughs> right. So, let's go. I think we only got four. Oh, what sick whip, hell? dog. That was a crazy transition. What in the <laughs> fuck just happened? Damn, we got a lot of. Okay. Are these books? Why do we have so many books in our garage? Uh, I don't know, psychology books maybe? Drive to hotel. Alright. Yeah, well, no, I mean, the books wasn't the, the books that were in the garage. Was the... Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is trippy. Look at that. Oh, that's little, a lot of fucking bugs, dude. Little butterflies. You guys don't need a therapist. You need a fucking exterminator. Can we run? No, we cannot. What the fuck? Uh, what? What's going on over here? Is that a child? Hello? Oh, God. I said, oh, it was Grandpa. Oh, it was Grandpa. Grandpa. Hurry up, boys, my therapist is here. <laughs> Hello, dear, I'll meet you in my room. Okay. Come on, what do I pay you for? I don't know. God, no wonder we haven't worked for like three months. These guys are creepy as hell. <laughs> oh this my. weird. She doesn't like, even have dystopian. a face. Oh shit. She's like, she's got like a wafer for a face. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like she like tripped and fell on a grill. Okay, wh his house is, we have to go to Grandpa's house? We didn't know, we go to the hotel. It's oh. in his room. Uh, Wait, you don't want to talk to the... I don't think we can talk. Okay. Ooh, hell yeah. <laughs> you were one of those fucking developers. Get the fuck out of here. Holy shit. <laughs> what? The therapist? Oh, that's you. Been a while since Pa signed up with that man. Hm. Your room is 204. Are you, don't make a mess. Are you, are you grandma? <laughs> yeah, that's right, grandma. <laughs> All right, room 204. Whoa. This is so oh trippy. Look at what that. The fuck? Is that a bull? Oh, it's Doug. It's Doug. What's that? Oh. You hear it's Thor? Alive. You know it, Doug. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you know it, Doug. I'll catch you around. I'm All so right. Bleep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Doug. Okay. Good talk. He's definitely high. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's like three feet off the ground. It's pretty high. Hey. TV bloke. The Muck TV. Okay, goodbye. Okay. All right. Should we Damn, keep going? Fucking Jake Paul ass. Say. TV bloke sure is cute. Can't seem to get attention, though. <laughs> I mean, he is the TV guy. He's pretty cute. Yeah, that little small ass head. Okay. 204. Oh, there it is. Wow. Nice. Ooh. That's not the music I expected upon our arrival. 
on the... Oh, cool. Flies in the trash can, too. Okay. Our bed looks extremely comfy. So... What exactly are we doing in here? Uh, I don't think anything yet. I think this is just our room, so... Huh. So maybe should we go to Grandpa's room, then? Oh, we'll go to somebody's room. I mean, look, it looks like these are all the rooms, right? Right. Okay. Well, let's head to... Uh, let's see what we got here. So... Is room 205? What happens if we disturb the, the people we're not supposed to see? Oh uh, my god. Maybe we shouldn't even be in here. Oh fuck. Whoa. <gasps> uh, hello. Oh, it's Ryder. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh. I got a lot of options. How's your uh, mother? Yeah, how's hey, your mother? Hey, bitch, how's your mom? <laughs> we just go in here. Hey, how's your mom doing? Pretty great. That's not what I heard last night. <laughs> oh! Wait, what? <laughs> she's retired. Okay, you she's want to... retired now and is getting into pottery. Oh, that's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> Still sends me some pots occasionally. Oh, I get it. Your mom's sending you pots. <laughs> she's a real sweet lady. Uh, she's real sweet. <laughs> Okay. She was real sweet last night. Woo! So, oh. Oh, we were supposed to do this one. Oh, okay. Oh, we got it. Oh. It's very author fucking weird girl skin condition. They're an alright person, though. She's a little sad. Ha, sounds like me. Oh, damn. So that's pretty <laughs> good. <laughs> oh, I guess we're done here. All right. Have, have a good... You uh... Your skin is great. All right. <laughs> all right. Let's go to... Uh... Okay, let's go to... So, 205. Let's go okay. to 205. Let's see what's going on here. Oh. <laughs> my <laughs> my p word like a goddamn solar eclipse okay <laughs> well that's good Wet to hear ass p word hey, hey. <laughs> all right 105 baby mechanic oh shit okay oh damn what's that on the ground is that oil <laughs> like symbols to me all right let's look up a little bit on this guy Damn kid assess with their fucking drive plug and spark shafts. A good sport though. Alright. Hey buddy. Sup dude? <laughs> we doing this? Uh alright, what should we ask him? Um how's it work, I guess? Uh I um what, about what are you looking forward to? Okay. After a couple of jobs I can afford to move the fuck out of here. Don't get me wrong. I love Granny, she's wonderful, but I don't know. The vibe is just getting kind of weird the past few years. Yeah, uh, I fucking noticed. <laughs> Have you seen Doug? <laughs> right. I think it has something to do with that dipshit husband of his. Oh, Grandpa? Yeah, great, yeah. Rides around like a king with a crown on his head. What a fucking loser. Damn. Alright, well. Um. Any recent, recent issues? My back's been really killing me. I guess that's more of a physical thing. Uh. Alright, how's your mom? <laughs> Fucking hate that bitch! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, was living, I was living back at home. Oh god. She was always stressing me. <laughs> Made everything about this goddamn certification test. <laughs> Don't even get me started. Like she knew what I needed for my career. I was happy to get out of there. I do this. What do you miss? Never mind. Okay, that's all we have time for. All right, well. Does that count? I, I, oh, I guess so. Yeah. I mean, we only asked the writer like one question, just asking how his mom was. Yeah. So, all right. I mean, she's doing pretty well. I don't I know mean, what are we supposed to follow that up with? He God, seems pretty normal. That was normal. fucking loud and I'm, shit. Wait, what is that? There's another dude floating in the hallway. Oh. Hello. Ah. It kind of looks like Geo dude a little bit. <laughs> hey. How are you, stranger? My brother's stuck outside. He thinks I'm getting him something to slither out. I'm actually looking for something to lick my butthole. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you even have an asshole? <laughs> he should be fine. Stuff like this happens often. Oh, does it? All right. Does he? I'm trying to do that. I'm trying to see that. Well, well they, I think they purposely blocked his booty hole. I guess he's saving it for someone special. <laughs> A bloatman. Okay, great. Room service? I don't want anything. Okay, great. Should we ch wait? Does I mean should we check up on his brother in the alley? Oh, is he outside? I think so. Yeah, let's, let's check him out. Let's go. Oh shit! 
Oh, oh, shit. Is that Big Bro? I think that's Big Bro. Hey. Hey, Big Bro. J Flow. Sup, dog? Yeah, I'm pretty stuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, though. My little brother's out getting some butter and lube. I should be out soon. Uh, your brother's looking for something to look his butthole. Yeah, your brother's on a whole nother level of existence. <laughs> you gonna say something or. See ya. All right, never mind. He's All just right. stuck. It's time to drive me a little bit. Sup? What are you looking at? Oh, yeah, that's my friend Floaty. <laughs> Don't worry about him. This happens a lot. Okay. All right, well, 104 plays only. Oh, oh God. Okay. Hi, Tad. That actually scared me. Don't let the bosses know I'm in here. The hotel short staffed as it is, so they got me doing double duty. Triple even. Oh, uh, triple duty? Damn. Damn. I'm just gonna lie down here until it's time to go go. It just looks like a squished E.T. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, baby. Maybe we should have read the notes on this one. Okay, let's check it out. Some sort of religious robot has some followers and shit. Can't really understand what those chumps seen him. Messiah 2000. <laughs> I have waited for you. Welcome. Okay. Uh, okay. How's your work? I am the Messiah of the religion of the X. Me and my followers have been striving over the past few years. We are to craft the most powerful, optimized spirituality. I do like when things are optimized. It hasn't quite caught on. Financially, we have yet to break even. I don't offer a doubt of my success, however. Typically religious... Wait, typically religions take many, many years to catch on. This is something I have prepared for. As I am constructed mostly of cold steel and pistons, I have no concern for time or the process of growing old. My disciples, however, concern me. They have been with me for years now, preaching our good word. They will be dead before my vision is fully attained. It would be incorrect to say I feel bad for them. A personage, so chock full of gears as it is, has little room for feelings of sympathy. However, a part of me does wish I could bring them into the future we have tried to create. How's your uh, mom? Right. <laughs> <laughs> I know nothing my creator know the purpose of making me, nor why did they dumb me and... Dude, come on. Is your mom hot or not? <laughs> uh, is your mom a dank sex bot or what? <laughs> the religion of the X will dominate. Now it will ascend. All right, Great. didn't say shit about that. Later, dog. Have fun, <laughs> I don't like guys. these guys, though. What the <laughs> hell are they? All I right. Well, let's just go to Grandpa. Yeah, it's Grandpa time. Uh, maybe the other way. Oh, there we go. That's probably uh, the person who really needs therapy anyway. Oh, here we go. The golden door, baby. Oh, his room kind of, his, his song kind of slaps. All right. All right, Grandpa. This this is a... It's going to be a big All one. Right. Hello, dear. You certainly took your time getting up here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. We're doing just fine up here on Todd Street. Just fine. My wife and I have owned this hotel on the great for hundreds of years. Got some work to do around here and there. Always keeping busy around here. There's always something with these tenants. Tenats. Tenats. <laughs> Tenats. You know what I'm saying, brother. <laughs> <laughs> well. I met this guy says he gave me a hundred apricots per week for it. Whoa, what a steal. What a great deal that would be. Lodges would appreciate a nice apricot staying in the lobby, I'm sure. We could probably move the TV to make room. But what about TV bloke? You know that, <laughs> oh shit. You know that TV bloke doesn't even live here. Damn, he just comes in to watch TV. Damn. Oh, God. Never has. Never even rented a room for the night. TV bloke lives a few blocks away. I followed him home one time. Every morning he wakes up and comes down here for his entire day. What was I talking about again? Bro, you're not sure. All right, well. I'm paying someone to come and fix the lights in the hallway. I don't know if you noticed, but uh, the lights aren't censored. This goes back to people we bought from. Apparently they put the holes for the wires off center. And when they noticed, they had already put in half of the lights. I say it's time for a change, even if it is a little spendy. Okay, Grandpa. Any recent issues? My wife hates me. Okay. All right, that, that seems like, like an a, issue. Yeah, it seems like an ongoing issue. That was pretty topical. <laughs> I've never been good with money. 
I, I've noticed. Let's see how I heard this crown for a <laughs> Let me tell you, bad idea. With what money did you buy this? How are we gonna survive if you keep buying shit? It was a whole argument. Just stop paying attention to me after that. <laughs> I haven't got these two to start carrying me around. Oh, that's the life. That's gotta be pretty costly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Rather than doing their work around the hotel, of course. She doesn't even care. She just started working their jobs without a word. This has been really weighing on me, I tell you. This is the whole reason I put my name on the list of patients I gave to your boss. I mean, yeah. Oh god. Feels good to talk to somebody about it. Okay. Hey, How's mom. your mom? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my mom was a wonderful woman. She passed many summers ago. I remember the funeral. I would hope so. They put leaves and flowers in her hair. Reminded me of a garden. I was working on putting one in the front lawn of the hotel. Bought all this wood and soil. And seeds. Yummy. But then I don't know what happened. I just didn't get built. I think I still got the wood laying around here somewhere. Alright, well that's all, that's that's all, all we, we have time for. Right? <laughs> Alright. Well, I think we knocked everybody out. Yeah. Let's go, baby. Where's the exit? I think it's right there. Oh god, yeah, that's like really hard. It's the same fucking color as well. Alright, well. Now what? Um, and do we just leave? We just fucking peace out? I guess. Are we done? Huh. What the fuck? Who the fuck is that? Were they always there? I don't think so. The end is a guy. Eee! Yay, sports. <laughs> okay. See ya. <laughs> Yay, yeah, it's in the E. <laughs> it's in the E. <laughs> yeah. In and out, in and out. Make up your damn mind. Alright, now I'm still bitch. <laughs> Employee shit. Two oh four. Oh. Uh. Wait. Hello. Is this our therapist? It's boss. Oh, it's the boss, boss man. Oh. Hey, kid. You did it. You talked to at least a, a couple of patients. Oh well, whatever. We <laughs> we really just gotta show off faces. You didn't even need to talk to anybody. Anyway. Uh, I thought I'd drop by to check in. If you're all done here, I can take you home. Just step into the gate and I'll send you off. I promise I won't drop you like last time. Sorry about that, by the way. <laughs> okay. Thanks, boss Ooh, man. Wait, moon portal? What in the world? Fuck it. Okay. Wait, that's not jam. Oh, we're dropping. Well, my friends, that was Hotel on the Great. Not sure what the fuck went on, but, uh, you know. You know what? I like the aesthetics. <laughs> that was pretty interesting. Uh, I have the girl talking about her puss. All right, guys, later.